this is our page and if we click the plus uh, icon here we have a structure of sections that is if you haven't activated the flex option which i haven't here so here we have a section uh, or structure and elementor is giving some it's giving you some preset uh, options here if we go with this one goes right on the top this is just a single a section with one column this one here is the column or, or we can add three or we can add more you know you get the idea but what can you do with that well the most common thing i do with the section is you know it's the first thing i use if i want to create a hero uh, a hero section or like a banner on the front page of my website so let's see so here what i can do i can put a background picture on it and let me show you what happens if i don't do anything if i just go and pick an image let's find some image here let's do oh are we hungry uh let's go with this one you see it doesn't really show much but you have to adjust the height so we go back to layout and we go to height and on this one i'm going to select mean minimum height and now we're getting somewhere now i can give it here whatever i want 800 pixels if it was now yes or 200 or you know whatever value you want 500 or you can use the view height option here and you can say okay i want 50 percent of the page or i want 100 you know it's going to show for the entirety for the entire page it's going to show this image on the entire screen sorry not page screen uh, but let's say we stick to pixels for now and let's give it 500 okay but i want the picture to be more visible then i go back to style and i'm going to go to center center and i'm going to size it to cover and now i have everything here now what more can i do on this section i can add some text here in this column here we have this column as well which we can do stuff here i mean if we increase the padding let's say we put some big numbers here uh, maybe because it doesn't have anything now here this is empty now but if we put let's say put some text and here i can write welcome to my website uh, maybe not use blue what i can do i can use uh, i don't have more colors let's, let's add a white uh, add colors and I'm going to name it white just because and that's an update and back to editor and here I'm going to I select I prefer to work with global colors because it's easier and I can do that but I can put some shadow here right look you can put some shadow or you can put some stroke uh, which i don't really want to on this one but oh well became black or you can if you want to depending on your design i'm gonna do some shadow instead right and uh, but now you see that this column is in the middle what if i want to have it on the bottom then we go back to the section and you see here column position middle here we have some options i can put it on top and it goes on top or i can put it in the bottom there it is and i can do some more here i can give some padding and it increases the whole height of the hero because it creates some padding it wants to put in squeeze in 50 more pixels but you can make those adjustments to fit your design and you can do it however you want and uh, and here layout you can also if you want you can make the column oh, no well it's only one column you can add a column if you click on that add a new column if you want to have something else here maybe you want to have another image let's say 
uh, and here let's put something like this for instance this is just an example it is too big let's try and make it a bit smaller and uh, style width see here we can go to the image settings or in the middle tab with the uh, styling and you know you can do those things here you can adjust it uh, here you can select the alignment we can put it there or in the center as it was or there we can change the width of its column uh, so and maybe that can be there so what else can you do you can add a button like click to action I'm, I'm not saying it looks good okay this is just a demo okay i hope yours will look better let me know in the comments share <coughs> if you use this tutorial to create a hero image or something like that share it in the comments i would like to take a look at it uh, but you can have like a click to action maybe not exactly that image but you can have welcome to my website uh, and here you can have like grab my uh, free freebie my free ebook and you can have like an image a thumbnail of that it doesn't have to be that kind of a background here you can have something else or you know or um, subscribe to my newsletter or contact me or whatever your call to action here but this is how you work with sections and columns and you can add inside the column whatever widget or element you want from this sidebar. If we publish it, let's take a look. We don't have a header or a footer, I know. This is just to show you how to work with sections and columns, but that's how it looks. Thank you for watching. I hope it helped you this tutorial. Let me know in the comments how did it go for you. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tutorials like that. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.